So guys, I'd like to welcome you all back to some more Fallout 4. We are almost done the game. The reason why I have uh, my game on the main menu screen is because I just wanted to see how it looks like at such high definition uh, since it's 60 frames per second and everything. But yeah, that's basically all I wanted to say. Let's continue with the game, guys. I hate the loading screen. It takes forever to load. I really hate that. If it takes too long, I apologize. I'm sorry. But... I don't know. Games like these, like... game Games like Fallout 4... Uh... Mostly... Uh, most of the games made by Bethesda... Are normally very slow because the games are huge. They take up a lot of space. So that's why the loading screens are pretty long. And yeah. Good to see you. Good to see you too. <laughs> okay, let's go. Wait, hold on. Yeah. What are we supposed to do right now? Let's check. Speak to Dr. Lee. Okay. Also, this video is going to be in between 14 to 17 minutes because I don't want my videos to be too long. Otherwise, things are going to start At last, we have power appearing bad. To our needs. Dr. Lee. What can I do for you? Sean says it's time. Ah, that. Well, let's get to it. Dr. Orman, over here, please. It's time. What now? I'm still working over the code that the robotics sent over. The algorithm is a mess. It's not even close to peak efficiency. It would seem we've run out of time. Let's go. We're going to cover the basics of the operation as it stands now. Dr. Orman has done most of the prep work, so I'll let her explain. Okay, thanks. Is this really exciting, or is it just me? So, you know that the Brotherhood's main operation is at the airport, right? I'm aware of that, yes. Okay, good. If they were a little less intelligent, we wouldn't even be talking about this. We'd have just swarmed them with synths. But they're not idiots. They've managed to generate an EM field that's messing with our ability to relay in. So we just relay onto the airship and sabotage it? Won't do us any good. There's no direct connection between their robot and the airship. So the immediate area around their encampment is a no-go. They don't, however, have the entire airport covered. We can relay you in to a point at the edge of the airport, and then you can get in and take down the generators. We'll have the element of surprise, if nothing else. Exactly. You'll have surprise on your side. Should give you some time before they can organize a real defense. For every generator you take down, it means we can start relaying in synths, giving you even more of an advantage. And... Oh! I almost forgot. Take these. Oh, thanks. Grenades? Sure, I can always use grenades. No, no, they're not grenades. This thing and I haven't come up with a good name for it yet, it basically deploys a beacon marker. Wherever they land, we can lock onto them and relay synths directly to that position. If there's a hot spot, you can drop synths right on it. We've only got a few of these, so put them to good use. Don't go tossing them into the bay. Okay, that's pretty good. I'm impressed. I know, right? I mean, thanks. I thought it was neat. But still, it's just to help. Your real job will be to reach Liberty Prime. You know the deal with that, right? It's the Brotherhood's giant robot. Right. They think it's their ultimate weapon. We're going to show them it's ours. We've taken everything we know, made a few modifications based on what we think they've done with it in the past 10 years. And, this part was my idea, uploaded the whole thing into a modified synth capable of delivering the virus directly into Liberty Prime. The little guy is going to be exposed and vulnerable, so you'll have to keep an eye on him. Make sure he doesn't get shot, you know? My game is really laggy, guys. I'm very sorry about that. With Liberty Prime on our side, that'll give us a hell of an advantage. He's not going to go stomping around, and he won't be taking orders, but he will have his weapons and targeting systems overridden. And he'll absolutely recognize their airship as the primary communist target in the Commonwealth. 
So your end goal is ultimately pretty simple. Get to the robot, then hold the position while the synth does his thing. Oh, and don't worry. We'll pull you out of there before everything explodes. If you have any questions, now's the time to ask. Otherwise, they'll be waiting for you in the relay room. Liberty Prime, plan, uh, plan B, backup. Okay. What have I got for backup? Once the generators are down, we'll be able to throw everything we've got at them. And I do mean everything. Have we got a plan B? We don't need a plan B. This will work. Anything else? No questions. Let's do this. Very well. Good luck to you. Oh, for goodness sake, I can't find my notes anywhere. Wow, why is my game so laggy? I don't understand. Surplus power should translate to increased efficiency and productivity. I really don't understand why that happened. That pissed me off right there. I'm just like, what? I would never want to put a uh, YouTube video like this. Okay. So I guess... It's at the top? Isn't it? Or where is it? Alright, let's check where it is. Because I'm really not sure. It's my responsibility to make sure this place runs smooth. Where the hell is that? Wow. Let's jump. That was sick. Where where do we go? Hold on. And what's our objective? Use the relay to reach the airport. Oh, the relay. Oh. Oh, that's all the way up. So we gotta use this thing. I wouldn't be here if not for your son. Damn, the elevator's fast. Futuristic stuff. I love going in this elevator, it's amazing. Oh, our power armor is damaged. What the hell? What happened to our power armor? Hold on, let's check for a second. Uh. Oh man. Oh no! Oh god! Oh, this is not good. I'm gonna have to go all the way to Red Rocket Station and repair it, I guess. Let's do that first. That's not good. We're not ready right now. So let's travel all the way here. And we can repair it. Alright, so we're at Red Rocket Station, and move that aside. I don't know why that's there. Okay, let's put our power armor here for a second. There we go. Now let's craft. Try not to sever what we're gonna do here is we're gonna repair this and time to talk now. that. 
Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six. All right. That's good. Now we can uh, now we can equip them, I guess. Yeah, we can. Obviously. So let's go to inventory. There we go. Why am I even carrying this? Let's put it right here. Oh, you know what we should do? We should um repair everything else just in case because everything else seems to be damaged as well a little bit. Even though You're giving me the silence. Even though it's not like huh? completely damaged. So that's 74. Okay, we'll do that. That's done. There we go. Now we're good. So now we can use the relay core to travel. Come on, hurry up. There we go. Why do we always end up facing the wrong way? Come on. Wow. So I guess for the ending, since you get to choose it, we'll go with the Institute. Because why would I want to turn against my own son? Seriously. Like, why would we want to turn against our own son? That's just stupid. We wouldn't want to do that. Like, if you think about it, you spent so much time finding him. And, like, you've literally worked your ass off to find him. And now, later on, you, you turn against him. That's a big, huge waste. And that makes no sense. So it doesn't count. Yeah, I do. Follow me. <laughs> uh oh. Brotherhood, armed forces. Level 9. checking what level what about that guy over there wait hold on Le oh my god damn we're screwed he's level 17 okay 